Uganda, the Pearl of Africa, an endowed tourism destination with extraordinary natural beauty and happy people, making it the friendliest country to visit. A home to one of the highest mountain ranges in Africa, the Mountains of the Moon, the source of the mighty River Nile with vast wildlife and unique flora and fauna. This is Karamoja Sab region, one of Uganda's unique and most conserved areas where tourism that is inclusive manifests itself. The sweet thrill of change in the atmosphere, the scenery of the plains and of course the sounds of the jungle in Kidepo Valley National Park. Hush, listen to the sounds of nature. Tourism is not only important to me, but also to the community where I come from. The benefit that I've got from uh, tourism, I've managed to educate my children, and uh, one, one of them is now in, in year one in the University of Makerere. And I've also bought some, some plot of land within Karenga town. I would have said even my children in future doing this job after I retire, because I can breathe, I can see animals, I can, uh, I can have friends from America, friends from UK. representing Karatunga as a tour operator for Karamoja. We benefit from tourism, of course, by creating income of revenue, but that's not where it ends. You know, uh, we work together with the local communities, uh, with tour guides, local service providers, uh, different hotels. And at the same time, we also enable other tour operators and travel agents to sell their similar experience and all together build Karamoja through tourism. Believe it or not, from the time a tourist starts planning a journey to any destination of their choice, the host destination begins to feel the impact. When visitors come here to visit our village, they bring some money and we, we get that money to take our children to school and we enjoy with them everything. We have left even pushing because of the donation they, they bring for us. We have got money through guiding, uh, not within Lorkul but outside other communities, especially the Ik community. Whenever I take the tourists there, uh, they pay me what's called full day activity. And this money has helped me to buy the motorbike that has been, I've been using. Like whenever I'm called in the park, come and take tourists or do game drives within the park. Here, they don't wait for ceremonies to sing and dance. It's a hobby. It's part of them. And tourists from all over the world are attracted to this unique culture. Everyone has a role to play, from tour operators, the hospitality players, to the simple owner of a manyata in this part of the Pearl of Africa. I used to dig like some vegetables like beetroot, coriander, uh, radish. Purposely, I have actually people to buy, like some lodges. I used to supply like a dere, savanna. Uh, even spot hunting, they actually they give me a support. I get also income from them and I support also my family and that's the way I used to survive. I joined tourism when I was 21 years. I've lost from housekeeper to a manager and I'm happy having now three kids and uh, my family is very happy because I support them. The, the money I get from, uh, from tourism and they're happy. I'm always paid something. At least I get a guide fee of 50,000. It was my first time to see the currencies called dollars. So all that money actually entered in my pocket because of this tourism. This is tourism that needs all of us. This is tourism that is inclusive. Keep traveling, keep changing lives.